cyber attacks are actually done through uh, people doing things which actually offers uh, entry points to your system, typically emails with uh, special viruses attached to it. So yes, it's very important that you get actually the attention to everyone to the problem, to educate them what they can do, what they cannot do. The, the thought about protecting against cyber attacks has to be part from the initial design process, not just at the end where you say, oh, I should probably also find an answer to that one. This needs to be uh, more and more a, a natural way of doing, which it still isn't, especially if you're in infrastructure projects, because that hasn't been very high on the agenda, at least uh, for quite some time. And so we really need to have everyone understand, even if he thinks he's, he is not running an IT system, but he might have an embedded system which he is uh, deploying and he has to think about himself, is this going to be connected to an internet, is it going to be uh, without connection which would protect it better and so you need really to introduce that one at the initial design to avoid that afterwards you have uh, lots of surprises which you cannot manage.